All right, folks, we are back. More Flash Gaming. Uh, we're going to be playing another favorite of mine, uh, this time from crazymonkeygames.com. Uh, we are going to be playing Raiden X. Uh, run Adobe Flash. Full screen. So that is a very small window. A whole 2.75 megabytes of gaming goodness. Um, so I don't know if you're familiar with the Raiden series of games. Um, they, this, there's no, no actual official affiliation with them. This is a fan, fan tribute. Um, so these were kind of bullet hell, uh, arcade games, uh, as a matter of fact. Um, they're all very good, uh, if you like bullet hell games. Um, have pretty good music, too. Again, it's a really occurring theme here with, uh, what we're doing. Um, most of the Raiden games are actually available on PC. They were ported from, you know, their arcade or consoles or whatever. Um, this is getting repetitive, so let's just click start. Oh man, this is so low quality, but it's just so great. Oh, the music. Mm. Alright. Love this stuff. Okay, I'll stop talking about it. The other Raiden games, uh, Raiden 1, Raiden 3, 4, and 5 are all on PC, but for whatever reason, Raiden 2 was never released on PC. Doesn't make any sense. This is the solution to that. Raiden X, this is a fan made port of Raiden 2 in Adobe Flash. It's ridiculous. He redid the music. This is based off of the actual music from the game. He hand drew all of this stuff and animated it. All based off of the original games. It's pretty darn incredible, if you ask me. Um, I didn't know that at the time. You see, this came out in 2005. Back then, I was like, wow, this is awesome. I didn't, I didn't know anything about Raid. But this was like, wow, this is, this is, this is amazing. Uh, anyway, uh, graphics, smooth, oh yeah, uh, difficulty, this game is very hard, so, uh, yeah, we're gonna do it on easy, I don't wanna hear any crap, um, I'll probably still die a ton, if you die in one hit, you have like 16 lives, but you still die in one hit, um, and uh, I used to be able to beat it on like the hardest difficulty, but that was when I had no life and played this game constantly, and had uh, built up significant muscle memory. Um, all right, so here we go. It's uh, Z, Z, and X in the arrow. This is all you need. Um, and we have little power-ups here. Three different colors. Purple is. Probably one of the better ones. It's just a giant home laser. Um, we also have uh, missiles or homing rockets. You know, it's rockets or homing missiles. I um, The downside to you know having a homing laser beam. Oh god, just pick up the wrong thing. I just go bad at this. Um, Oh, there we go. Died already. Jeez. I suck. Um. It's all good, man. Uh, yeah, the downside to this, as I was saying, is that they deal less damage. Um, so that's the first boss. There's a second stage. Coming. Um, it gets, it gets much harder. And after all, it's only the first level, and somehow I already screwed it up. <laughs> uh, 
but yeah, this this setup right here, the purple laser and the uh, home illnesses, is the ultimate in not having to care or aim. Um, also, this game would love to rub it in your face whenever you would die. Um, but, well, not die, but whenever you would get the game over. Constantly pop up and be like, oh, the suffering comes with them. Uh, yeah, whatever you ran out of life. Um, it's by some, somebody called Aeschylus. He's like some Greek philosopher or something like that. Uh, and I mean, you know, they're not wrong. It was very difficult to beat it on normal. I don't know. Settings before. Um, it still seems more or less the same. The amount of enemies and shots on the screen. These things really, really pick up in the later levels. Um, I think if anything, they may it may have slightly reduced the amount of HP that enemies have because uh, I don't think the purple uh, beam really did this much damage. Let's get the, the blue laser. So this is the most damaging weapon. As you can see, we just ripped that guy a new, a new one. Um, yeah, I think they definitely just lowered the amount of health that enemies have. Um, so whatever. We'll leave the homing missiles so we at least have something. We'll keep the, the death laser. I first started playing this um, back in the day, uh, it was more or less all I could do to get past this level. <laughs> uh, but eventually, like I said, I played it enough that... Oh god. also feel like the controls are a little inaccurate, but that's okay. Um, but yeah, I played it enough that I had be able to just anticipate where all the enemies were with all their shot patterns or built up enough muscle memory that I could be, get to the final level of the game without getting hit. Um, I get hit maybe like once or twice with the, uh, the final boss. Um, and that's the cool thing, once you, once you beat the boss you essentially do uh, new game plus. You start over with all your power-ups and get a million points. And you basically just get to see how far you can go. Uh, we're not going to do that once once we get to the uh, final boss. Uh, yeah, once you have max power up level, you just get points for picking them up. Uh, I'm just picking them up so that they're off the screen and I don't accidentally pick up the wrong color one. So that can really screw you. Next boss coming right up. Again, it'll probably die really quick, so we won't really get to see too much of it. But there's these dumb little side cannons here. Yeah, wow. Alright. Maybe I should have left it on normal. I don't know. Um, I'm mostly playing this for the music, honestly. And the nostalgia of just playing this again. Uh, yeah, I probably would have died quite a bit um, if it had realistic health, but whatever. Uh, this part would always screw me up, because these guys only shoot their shot after you kill them. And for whatever reason, my mind would just kind of blank on that fact. and be like, oh, they're dead, they can't hurt me anymore. I think it's all one guy that did it. 
Oh god. I was just trying to think about the ah, it's, it's, it's all downhill from here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh. Yeah, dying is a real Alright, we are basically maximum damage now. But also maximum annoyance because we don't have anything to Yeah, wow. <laughs> That's okay. Um, this is the first time that I've played this in a very long time. I remember the bosses, I don't really remember much else. Well. Um, and then, oh, geez, this is why I need homing stuff. Oh, yeah, there's bombs. I haven't used one of those yet, have I? Um, probably 
save myself from dying if I did. Because, you know, they clear all the shots on the screen. But for whatever reason, I never really used them for that purpose. Perhaps I should start. I'll probably do that right here because this jerk. Oh, what? It still killed me? Oh, no. I used the bomb and he still killed me. Uh, yeah. Anything that comes from behind me just really, really messes with me. Um, tell you what. We will save it just in case. Because we are. Oh, no. I don't want to save this very hard. Oh, 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 dear. Oh, dear. Not the place to have no weapons. Gosh, oh, wrong thing. Looks like we might be needing that save after all. have one damage, like one boning thing, we're generally okay. Ooh. This missile is the blue laser or whatever, as long as we have a mix. We have one bomb. Our weapons are all intelligent use of bombs we might be able to might be able to get through. Otherwise I'm gonna have to uh, figure out I'll just redo it while it didn't really take too long to get here. But yeah no I, I, at one point I was so good in this game that I would do challenges to beat it with only certain weapons. do two more attempts.
Hi. thing. Right. actually still a thing. Um, a bunch of other raiding stuff. And we can say continue. And hey, look at that. We're back where we started. We had all some weapons and stuff to keep them. But we don't, so we didn't. Anyway, <laughs> that's going to do it for this one. That was Raiden X. Um, yeah, sorry, I was so bad on... What was that? stage 7 or 8 or whatever it was, but that was just a poor setup from the preceding level. If I had had any other weapon, or even just basic homing missiles, it would have been fine. Anyway, that's going to do it for this one. Um, I think in the next one we'll tackle uh, Sunny 2, or maybe just some other, some other random small one-offs that I recall playing and enjoying. So, see you in the next one. Thank you all for watching.